Hi guys, today I'm doing a review on the VS Sassoon 3Q hair dryer and this is what the product looks like. So what's different about this hair dryer compared to other hair dryers is that it is a brushless hair dryer which means it doesn't have um, the brush mechanics inside um, this bit of the hair dryer which makes it more lighter and also what I really love about this is how quick and easy it dries your hair. Um, I will show you guys a demo video of how I use the hair dryer and um, to be honest it's for me I am not really a fussy hair type of person I just like my hair straight if I want to curl it I will use a curler so just give you guys a quick rundown of what I thought of the hair dryer so firstly it's very very light this is amazing I think especially if you have thick hair or you spend a lot of time um, styling or blow drying your hair having a light tool like a hair dryer um, makes it so easy and um, very easy to use. It has three buttons here on the side. One's for cooling, one's for the power, so how how strong do you want the airflow, and um, one is also for the heat, so how hot do you want the air to be. So I really like this um, hair dryer. Like I said, it's very easy to use, and also it comes with two nozzles. So it comes with this one, which I, I like to use. It's um, really good for straightening um, your hair with the hair dryer, and because of this, I actually don't need to use a brush when I blow dry my hair. Um, you can also use it without this attachment, so just like this. Um, this obviously will um, provide sort of dispersed air, while this gives concentrated air and will, it will help you um, get the straight look you want. And it also comes with um, this diffuser. So this is really for um, wavy hair. I don't have naturally wavy hair, so I don't ever use this. But it does come with this if you are interested. Also, what I like about this technology, like I said, because the, it doesn't have that brush technology, it's much lighter and um, very easy to use and also it doesn't compromise on the airflow. The air, the amount of air that comes through it is very, very strong. It makes, um, it just, I found that it dried my hair very, very quickly, which I really liked. It's a 30 degree day today in Sydney and I felt like, um, and I felt like it wasn't very hot. Um, because it's so quick to blow dry your hair, you don't need to spend a lot of time blow drying it I'm putting it on high heat which is great. Also what I like about this tool is that um, it is quite a quiet hair dryer for, for what it is. I mean hair dryers typically aren't quiet but for what it is it's not very loud. I really like this. I also think the size of it is very easy. It's very intuitive just like your hair dryers. You've got your standard buttons here. The hand fits nicely around the handle and it's a good size. I really like this. Um, in terms of the quality of it, so I've only used it today. I would probably like to use it a bit more, um, maybe at least for a few months to see how it holds up. But so far, I am really liking it. So if you are looking for a hair dryer that is light, easy, um, or if you're on the lookout for a new hair dryer, I definitely recommend giving this a go. I think um, it blew dry my hair very quickly, but then again, I do have um, quite fine hair. I don't have a lot of hair, but um, I found this very easy to use. Uh, my old hair dryer was very, very heavy um, and big. And I think for this size, it's quite powerful. So definitely recommend this. I hope you guys found this useful and I will put in a video of me actually using the hair dryer. So thank you for watching. If you have any comments, please leave it in the box below and I'll see you in my next video. Bye.